David, the health commissioner is now ordering all teachers, first responders, and medical workers employed by the city of New York to be tested for the virus if they show any symptoms, and there will be consequences if they don't comply. David. All right, Whit Johnson again tonight. Whit, thank you. We know many of you at home have questions on this, so let's get right to Dr. Jen Ashton, our medical editor. And she was here in Washington in the last 24 hours, part of that small group meeting with the vice president. And, and Jen, I know you're aware of this, this very small study out of Singapore that looked at the rooms of patients, bedrooms and bathrooms of the patients. It showed a significant amount of the coronavirus in the rooms when they tested. This number got our attention. 87% of the surfaces testing positive, uh, somewhat alarming. But then after being disinfected, that was a bit reassuring. It went down dramatically, David, showing.